Hey there, this is Scott with thecraftsmanblog.com and I wanted to show you a fun little trick today to uh, take care of your windows after you've glazed them. Uh, after you glaze your windows, we just finished this one, you can see in the reflection here that there is a whole lot of grease and uh, oil left on the uh, window. And now you don't really want to have that sit there for forever, so I've got a uh, quick little fix for that that you can use. A lot of uh, professionals will use something called whiting and you can just uh, take some whiting and brush it on the window and it'll get rid of the uh, oil. Whiting's kind of hard to find. It's also kind of expensive so I have a solution for you. Look right here. This is the powdered uh, joint compound. Uh, just the, uh, the average bag you'll get at Home Depot or Lowe's. This one's the 20 minute it really doesn't matter what uh, time you get, 20 minute, 45 minute, 90 minute. It's always fun to ask them when you ask for it at the store and they're like, which one do you want? Uh, it doesn't really matter. Everybody has a preference. So I'm just going to take a little bit of this, just enough to fill my brush. I'm going to come up here and I am going to put it on the window like this. This is hard to do because I've got one hand on the camera trying to watch what I'm doing. But basically, the joint compound, and I'll just do the center here, you want to be careful not to mess up your new glazing, but the powder joint compound catches the oil, takes it with it, and you just want to be gentle. It also takes any of the extra uh, excess oil off of the glazing compound. It helps it skin over a little bit faster. And I get everywhere here. And now, you've got a pretty clean and oil-free window. Brush it off. If you want to use a compressor and blow it off, whatever you want to do, boom. No more oil on the window. Hope that helped. And for more tips, you can always visit thecraftsmanblog.com. And I uh, hope you enjoyed this, and your window glazing is going much smoother now.